right now we do know the number of people in detention is upwards of 44,000, yeah. and uh, about a fourth of those are kids. So these are these are the numbers we're dealing with, and these are the people that are, are spending this particular moment where it's supposed to be, you know, we're supposed to be joyous and we're supposed to be thinking about everything mm-hmm. we have going on mm-hmm. well in our life, and they don't have that luxury. So uh, hopefully with uh, the efforts of the campaign and those who are supporting us, we can make it at least a little bit more enjoyable for them than it's currently being right now. Well, that, that's important, Jorge, and I'm and I'm glad you're you're taking that on because w- what what is what's Christmas about if it's not about that? I mean, everyone's concerned about what's going on down there, but if we aren't really putting our concerns into real action, what difference does it make, folks? There it is. Uh, Go fund me, and this will provide basic services to immigrants coming through the Texas border, partnering with Refugee Services of Texas. And on GoFundMe, it's, it's not just a toy, correct? Yeah. That's so it. We, we've, that's the new name of the campaign. It's, just, it's not just a toy campaign because we, we do recognize that that entire thing of Wants are a luxury at this point for for some immigrants, and so we need to tackle the needs. And the needs are uh, a roof over their head, uh, some opportunity to put money in their pockets when it comes to getting a job at some point, right. and being able to provide for the family that more than likely came with them when they sought survival.